sponsored by MedCenter Health. Rather warm across the region right now as we look at Russellville. Nice, calm evening. We'll continue to stay calm until those breezes show up tomorrow afternoon. No rain expected for your Sunday, though. But temperatures across the region were very mild for that overnight low tonight. 72 here in Bowling Green is still at 1019. 64 into parts of Columbia and Edmonton. 61 in Burksville, one of our cooler areas, although many of us off to the west still in the 70s for tonight. Expecting a very mild evening. You may need to the fan or turn on the AC as we head into the overnight hours. Doppler Max showing we have a nice clean sweep here. We're just a little bit cloudy. A few of those showers just off to the north of our viewing area. We're not expecting any rain as we really move into tonight or tomorrow. Our main rain coming as we head into Monday. So don't have to worry about any of the strong to severe storms that are off doing some particularly bad damage off into the west. We are staying safe and sound here in South Central Kentucky. Taking a look across our region right now at the BG Ballpark, nice and comfortable at 72 degrees with a mix of clouds and clear sky. Elkton at 70 for this evening and Russellville once again setting at 70 degrees tonight. Very comfortable evening. If you do have to get out for tonight, it'll just be a touch milder than what we've seen over the past few evenings. Taking a look on Future Max, we may see a couple sprinkles tomorrow evening, but not expecting any widespread rain as we head into your Sunday evening and afternoon. Our main rain really coming as we head into early Monday and into parts of Monday evening and afternoon. As you can see, some of this could contain some gusty winds. We're not expecting any severe weather to be in our area tomorrow, but definitely some gustier winds within these thunderstorms. We're going to be breezy tomorrow as well with those winds anywhere from 15 to 20 miles an hour at times with gusts up to 30. But some of these could contain some rogue gusts, maybe up to 45 during the afternoon. These will continue to move through as we head into the evening hours, gradually moving out as we head into very early hours of Tuesday. We'll see some scattered shower activity even into Tuesday morning. We have a very unsettled pattern expected over the next week or so, but not everybody sees rain every day. So we'll be very scattered in nature and not expecting an entire washout every single day, but definitely some rain that we need to pick up on over the next few days and not a definite rain chance as we head over the next week or so. Taking a look at our drought monitor, this rain definitely not a bad thing though. We are starting to drift into the abnormally dry category, especially as we look to the south and western portions of the WBKO viewing area. Nice and sunny for your Sunday. One last nice day with definitely no rain as we head for the Sunday. 84 as our high, but those southwest winds a little bit breezy at times, anywhere from 10 to 15 miles an hour. We could see gusts up to 30 miles an hour. And there's a look at your forecast lottery high, expecting 82 for Bowling Green tomorrow. And over the next week or so, we'll be nice and mild across the region, anywhere in the 80s over the next week or so. But scattered storms will be likely anywhere from Monday into parts of Saturday. So you'll want to make sure you have the rain gear on you, the raincoat, the umbrella, and those overnight lows also staying rather mild as well with in the 60s and 50s. So make sure you have the AC cranked as we head over the next few days. And don't forget, you can always track out those rain chances on the WBKO First Alert Weather app.